2011 marks the 100-year anniversary of IBM. The company began as the Computing Tabulating Recording Corporation, or CTR, which was incorporated in New York City on June 16, 1911. It sold punched card equipment, commercial scales, and time recording devices. Thomas J. Watson Sr. became head of the company in 1914 and maintained that position until his death in 1956. He helped develop IBM's distinctive management style and oversaw the company's international growth. One of the richest men of his time, he was often called the world's greatest salesman. In 1924, the company was rebranded as International Business Machines, or IBM. The original logo remained until 1946. Throughout the 1920s, under Watson's leadership, IBM produced many innovations in punched card technology. By the 1930s, IBM was well known for its employee education, including technical training for women. During this time, they also revolutionized data processing and worked with the U.S. government on the processing of Social Security, the biggest accounting project of its time. The 1940s were a pivotal time for the company, as this is when the transition to large-scale electronic computing began. They created the data storage industry with the first hard drive. It used two-foot-wide disks and was the size of two refrigerators. During the 1950s and 1960s, IBM made the most popular and iconic business and scientific computers in the world. In 1961, IBM invented the Selectric Typewriter, which was a design sensation for 25 years. Their technology also guided U.S. space missions and helped put a man on the moon in 1969. Also in this year, the retail industry was revolutionized when IBM invented the magnetic strip on credit cards and later in 1973, barcode technology. In 1971, IBM sparked a technological revolution with the invention of the floppy disk. And again, 10 years later in 1981, with the invention of the personal computer. Today, IBM is in 200 countries and employs nearly 400,000 people and is ranked as the 20th largest corporation in the United States. To date, the company holds more patents than any other U.S.-based technology company.